Hi guys, it's Hanny from Eclipse All Sports and I'm just wanting to bring you a quick video review today. We're going to be looking at the SG Players Edition Cricket Bats that we've got available. Um, we did receive a new shipment of SS Bats. Uh, we did have a fair few Players Edition Bats or Players Bats. Uh, they've all sold. But we will be getting around to doing the SG and SS video reviews. Uh, so do stay tuned and if you're not subscribed, please do subscribe to the channel as we will be doing plenty of reviews over the next couple of weeks. Um, so we're going to start off with this lovely RP17 players bat from SG. So if you have a look there, you're getting stunning grains. You've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 grains. Very straight, very even. Lovely profile shape, you're looking at around a 39mm edge and around a 64mm spine and around a 22mm toe. This bat weighs 2 pound 8.9 ounce or 1160 grams. You've got a slight semi oval right at the bottom so if you're someone who holds it quite low down you will feel that there is a semi oval shape right at the bottom. It is a medium thickness, medium to thin I would say. Um, you've got a thin SG branded chevron grip so if you prefer a thicker handle or a thicker grip then I would recommend probably changing this one out um, it does go round from around about there so if you hold it a little bit further up it's going to feel round all the way up to the top it's an even thickness all the way up um, as for the fullness of the bat it is very full in shape there's no wood taken out and as you can see there it's a nice thick toe and the grains are going lovely straight and even through the toe so yeah lovely shape a lovely bat I'll just show you there so 28.9 ounce includes the factory wrapper and for me it picks up really nice I would say it probably feels around the 28 mark probably not too much heavier than that um, but like I say, it has got a thinner grip on there and with a thicker grip I think it will help the balance and feel of the bat but as it is, it feels nice and light in the hands and I would say it feels probably closer to 2.8 than 2.9 and as for the performance this is an SG test cricket ball it has been hit into the ceiling a fair few times so it is quite soft now and the ping on it is really good so if, if you're familiar with SG, their pressing is very consistent, the performance of their bats is very good straight out of the packet or even whilst they're still in the packet and yeah this one's no exception, absolutely flies and um, these bats are priced at £600 so if you'd like to pick this one up it is listed on the website, I will put the links in the description for each of the bats and there's also be a link up here somewhere as well so you can click on that and it'll take you to the SG bats and you can uh, have a look through and find the Rishabh Pant bat but yeah use the link in the description if you want the exact bat and um, yeah there's only one of these left in stock so the bat in this video is the exact same bat that you'll receive so moving on now and it is this lovely PS100 uh, Pretty Shaw sure uses this particular model and this is based on his player's profile you can see that it's a massive bat around a 40mm edge and probably 65-66 on the spine very thick down low nice thick toe probably 23-24mm on the toe again it's a thinner handle semi oval at the bottom round towards the top very full in shape nice thick toe grains are lovely through the toe and you can just see how thick that toe is there yeah really big profile shape so this one's weighing 29.4 ounce or around 11.74 grams but yeah it's a very big bat and again it picks up nice it feels really good in the hands it feels light it doesn't pick up heavy at all even though it's got a lot of wood down low you don't get a bottom heavy feel to it even with the thinner handle but like I say if you like a thicker handle or you know a bit more of a thicker feel in the hands then you can always add another grip 
or if you prefer a single grip you can always go for a thicker single grip um, but yeah it feels nice I would say this one probably feels again an ounce lighter maybe two eight and a half two nine maximum and it's still got the wrapper on grains wise I'm not showing you those very nice looking you've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten sorry if you can't see there 11, 12, 13, 14 grains. So all the information is listed up on the website, but you're looking at around 14 grains, and I'll just show you there. You can pause it and try and count them up yourself. Um, but yeah, lovely big bat. So we'll just give it a tap with the SG test ball. And again, the performance is fantastic. You can see that the rebound is very good. It's not been oiled or knocked in yet, but like I've said in many videos, the SG pressing is very consistent and obviously on their top players' bats you expect the performance to be very good. So if you're looking for something that a professional player would use, um, then I would certainly recommend taking a look at these SG players' bats. So we're going to move on now to the KL Rahul or the KLR1. Again, this profile shape, more of a mid-middle spine carried down into the toe and rounded into the toe. It nearly goes into the toe. It's a very long hitting area, very even shape. Nice to catch again. You're looking at around a 38, 39 mil edge and around 64 mil on the spine. Very full shape. This one I think is weighing in at 29.5. More of a noticeable semi-oval bottom hand and it stays semi-oval probably quite far up the handle probably up towards this part of the handle and yeah it goes slightly thinner and more round towards the top but yeah a noticeable semi-oval at the bottom and I would say it's slightly thicker uh, more of a medium thickness feels quite nice and you can see how thick that edge is and how even the thickness on the edges the shoulders are pretty thick as well and yeah very full in shape, lovely long hitting area, 29.5 or 11.76 grams. We'll just see how this one picks up. Yeah, it picks up really nice. I think with the even shape, uh, the wood is distributed nicely across the blade and with a slightly thicker handle, it picks up really nice and feels really well balanced. And I would say this one probably feels closer to that 2.8 uh, mark rather than two eight and a half two nine it feels nice and light in the hands uh, ping wise really good ping very responsive all three of these bats have performed very well this one feels really nice goes well up high so it's a nice long hitting area so you can see there peak of the spine starts to die off around about here peaks around about there at the midpoint so that's where the middle position is but then it carries on all the way down into the toe so you're getting plenty of wood further down the blade and plenty of wood up to around about the sticker there before it starts to die off um, so yeah it's a nice long hitting area really nice cricket bat that one um, so we're going to finish off with this beautiful Surish Rainer SR210 bat Maybe not beautiful in terms of the grain structure. Um, might not be the best looking one, but it's still a nice looking piece of willow. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten grains. So you've got ten grains. They're not perfectly straight, but they're nice and even. And it's a nice looking bat. A few little speckles, but other than that, it's very nice looking in terms of the grains. Um, edge size you're looking 39 40 millimeters and the toe thickness is around a 24 millimeters at the edge the spine is close to 65 66 millimeters and the shape is very full it's domed and you can see how thick that toe is there's no wood taken out and if you look down the handle you can see up at the top there's no wood being taken out at the top either so the, the weight is carried all the way up to the slice of the bat so no wood taken out at all this bat is super light at 27.5 ounce which is 1120 grams 
so a very light bat and a very big bat. Handle shape, semi-oval at the bottom, it stays semi-oval to around about here and then starts to go to around. It's a lovely feeling handling the hands. I would go with a slightly thicker grip, but I think with a thicker grip I think it would feel perfect. As it is now it still sits in the hands really nice and just look at that profile shape, it is massive and yeah really nice bat, 27.5 it feels like a feather in the hands I would say it feels like a kid's bat um, feels that light in the pickup, it feels like a harrow, probably a 2.6 harrow it feels really nice and light, lovely balance on the blade and yeah if you're looking for something that feels really light then I would certainly recommend this one but it packs a serious punch, the ping on this Absolutely. You can see the air just dropping the ball on the back and then a little tap and it's flying. It really goes well. The pressing on all these SG players bats, as you would expect, is fantastic and the performance is amazing. This one seriously goes. If you're someone looking for a really light adult bat, but you want something that packs a punch, and it's going to send the ball to the boundary then this is a really good option guys 27.5 11 20 grams really big specs no concaving at all in the bat so if you want in that super full profile nice big thick edges and high spine and thick toe but you want it in a light weight which is very hard to come by and you want in players performance players looks players specs then sr210 it's probably going to get snapped up very quickly so I would uh, check this one out before it's gone guys. So if you would like to purchase one of these bats um, they will be listed on the website for $599.99 um, that includes free UK mainland delivery it also includes this free SG players bat case um, it's a slightly different design to uh, last year's one which had a, like a tartan material so they've gone for the plain black look this time instead and if you're a customer that resides outside of the UK uh, the VAT will be taken off so this bat will be priced at £500 and if you would like to purchase it simply use the WhatsApp telephone number in the description drop me a message and we will get you a shipping quote and take the VAT off as well. So if you are new to the channel and you would like to keep up to date with the videos, uh, simply subscribe to the channel, uh, give the bell icon a click, and whenever we do an upload, you will get a notification, so you won't miss out on any of these stunning cricket bats. Um, so yeah, thanks again guys for watching. Until next time, I'll speak to you all soon. Bye-bye.